I would just like to start off this video by giving a huge thank you to EA Sports for making this video possible. <laughs> Yo, what is going on everybody? This is RBT and welcome to another Madden 19 exclusive video as today in Madden 19 Ultimate Team I'm going to show you guys how to progress your players and power up your players with a whole new system in this year's game And it's an incredible addition I must say so Starting off, showing you guys how to upgrade the core rookie cards. You can't get an upgrade on the overall, but you can upgrade their chemistries. And really cool this year in terms of powering up cards and when you upgrade them and stuff like that, you can refund your upgrade and like change your chemistries. And we'll get more in depth in just a second. But really cool how to every core rookie card, you can basically choose your chemistry. You obviously have the team chemistry of who the player got drafted for, but you basically can choose whatever chemistry you want. All it costs is training points which we'll talk about trading points here in just a second. And if you choose a chemistry and end up not liking it, you can refund it and get a whole new chemistry on your team at whatever point. And that is for all of the core rookie cards. Now, I do want to show you how you get training points is you quick sell every card you get for a specific amount of training points. This year, you no longer quick sell your cards for coins, which people, some people might take that and run with it in the wrong way. But in my opinion, this is a... Um, nobody really quick sell their cards for coins in the past anyway because at the end of the day you didn't get that many coins for actually quick selling cards so you quick sell cards this year for training points is a huge now I want to show you when you get a base version of a power up card which is a 68 overall Tom Brady they're very common they're probably very cheap on the auction block you can go ahead even if you don't have the base elite Tom Brady with just training points you can take that base power up card and power him up all the way Tom Brady specifically to like an 86 overall so I think this is absolutely huge and I love it. Obviously, if you have the base version of Tom Brady, you upgrade it all the way up to his final tier and then you can use his actual base elite in this upgrade system and then you can upgrade him to an 89 overall because I think his base card is 88 so you can get a plus one overall to his power up card. Now the cool thing like I said is you can refund everything so it's not like last year the main complaint last year in the power up cards you couldn't refund anything you couldn't like break the card back down obviously I don't have the wild card the, or the actual core elite of Tom Brady so I can't bring him to an 89 overall and bring him to tier 10. But anyways, I still think it's super dope. So somebody that opens up a lot of packs and you can just quick sell your cards for training points, you can basically just get the base version of Tom Brady and get an 86 overall Tom Brady for pretty much nothing. So I think that's super dope. Now, once again, you can select the team chemistry. And this is another point I'll bring in just a second when I actually show you. But you can pick whatever chemistry you want. And throughout the tiers of upgrading the player, you get to upgrade specific chemistry slots on your player's car we got a physical trait for tom brady and these are all new chemistries this year and the one i think is op is sprinter it gives you plus one to speed and now it does cost a thousand training points which is a lot of training points but to get an extra speed boost on your player could end up being pretty freaking massive so next, I'm going to show you the same exact way with Rob Gronkowski. We had his base power-up card. We didn't have his base elite, but we can upgrade him. We just had his base power-up card all the way up to like an 88 overall without even having to have his like 90 overall elite card. And keep in mind, like you can go ahead and you can just refund everything you want. You can refund the chemistry if you don't like the chemistry you pick. And I think it's a super dope si system because like I said last year, everybody was complaining about how you were locked in on a card. And this year is completely different. Now, I want to show you powering up a card to its fullest potential. Now, every single legend in Madden 19 can be powered up. So you have to have the lowest overall power-up card, Champ Bailey, to start off the upgrades, which was like, as you saw, a 73 overall, upgrading the tiers all the way up until where you actually need his legend card. And now, since we have him powered up using the trainer points, we add in the 91 overall full legend, Champ Bailey. We're gonna go ahead and add him to the set and we get a 92 overall powered up Champ Bailey. Like I said, you can refund that if you wanna go back and sell the 91 overall card, which is super dope. And this is really, really cool. You get to pick the chemistry this year and power up a card. And when it comes to the team chemistry, 
you can pick whatever team that player has ever played for. So even if a player played for a team for one year, you could use that team chemistry if you wanted to, because if maybe if it helped your team, because you have more players from that team on that card. So we want the Denver Broncos, of course, for Tam Bately for his team chemistry. And you see all these other team chemistries or these chemistries that you can add to his card if you have enough training points, which is super dope. Obviously, the better chemistries cost more training points, but we gave him pick specialist. Now, once again, we're going to give him a sprinter because that's just OP and I had enough training points, but it does, it does take quite a lot to get training points. But if you've got somebody that opens up a lot of packs, you're going to be able to get training points. So that is one thing you are going to be rewarded for this year is if you're somebody that does open up a lot of packs, even if you don't get the greatest cards in your packs, you can quick sell them for training points and use those to upgrade your cards. Now, here we go, upgrading Granny Moss. And this is another cool thing. I wanted to show you this because like showing in terms of, I think it's so cool because in the past they went ahead and picked what team that card got its team chemistry for. I remember as a Titans fan a couple years ago, I did a series on Steve McNair and the card was from the Ravens and dog, I was like, he's a Titan. But now we have the choice this year of what team we want that card's chemistry to be for as we get a ability slot for Randy Moss at the very final upgrade system. As you see, every team Randy Moss has ever played for, you could use that team chemistry. We initially chose Patriots just to show you guys you can change it if you want to. You can replace the chemistry for the Vikings. And this is extremely useful because like I said, if for one point you're building a team and it, like you have a player with a specific chemistry and then some other players you're adding to your team have different team chemistry, you can always go back and change if it would be helpful for your ultimate team. But to be completely honest, guys, like genuinely, I think this is like the coolest addition to ultimate team that has been a thing in years. Just super freaking dope. And I think this is gonna completely change ultimate team because it just gives you so much more custom ability than in years past i mean you can whatever chemistries you want you can power up the players to whatever overall you can like you can refund your power up so you're not locked in for the rest of the year and i think it's just so dope and i wanted to get your guys' opinion on this in the comment section below what do you think about the whole new power up system as we end up the video by powering up sean taylor but hopefully guys it did enjoy like i said let me know in the comments what you thought about all of this let me know if you think you're gonna be powering up your cards this year be sure to subscribe if you are new for more Madden 19 content. A ton, a ton of Madden 19 videos coming early on the channel today and in the next couple of days. And there's probably been a ton already uploaded, so go check them out if you haven't. But I'll catch you guys next time. Have a great rest of your day. God bless and peace.